The teaser trailer for the upcoming Ahsoka series has dropped, and aside from it looking amazing, I was left intrigued and wondering about several characters that appear in the trailer. One such character in the trailer that caught my attention is an Inquisitor. At one point, Ahsoka can be seen dueling with an Inquisitor, but it's yet to be stated which Inquisitor she's dueling. So, do we know who that Inquisitor is? Tinfoil hat and wild theory time. While it hasn't been officially stated which Inquisitor Ahsoka is dueling, I believe it's the 8th brother. If you take a look at the helmet that this Inquisitor is wearing, it looks very similar to the helmet that the 8th brother wears. In addition, the lightsaber of the Inquisitor Ahsoka's dueling has a hilt that very much resembles the 8th brother's. It's tough to tell, but the hilt appears to have buzzsaw-like teeth protruding out of it. This type of design was unique only to the 8th brother's lightsaber. His lightsaber was distinct among other double-bladed spinning lightsabers used by his fellow members of the Inquisitorius in that it had the unique ability to convert into a buzzsaw-like weapon that employed the handle while the blades were deactivated. The one issue with my theory is that that the 8th brother's lightsaber had mechanisms in place of the hinges on the emitter rails of their lightsaber, disallowing the 8th brother from folding the guard into a crescent shape. And, as we can see here, the Inquisitor that Ahsoka duels with has their lightsaber in a crescent shape. The other issue is that the 8th brother died in 3 BBY in the planet Malachor when Ahsoka, Kanan Jarrus, and Ezra Bridger travel to the planet in the series Star Wars Rebels. And after that point, all of the Inquisitors were dead and the Inquisitorius was no more. So whether or not that's the 8th brother, how can Ahsoka be dueling? an Inquisitor if they were all dead by 3 BBY. The obvious answer is that this could simply be a flashback scene. However, I actually think Ahsoka might be traveling through time in the upcoming series. In the trailer, we can very clearly see Ahsoka speaking with and dueling one of the Dark Jedi in the World Between Worlds. For those unfamiliar with the World Between Worlds, it was a mystical plane within the Force that served as a collection of doors and pathways existing between time and space, linking all moments in time together. We first learned of the World Between Worlds in Season 4 of Rebels, where Ahsoka Ahsoka was able to survive her encounter with Vader on Malachor from Season 2, only because Ezra from the future was able to access the world between worlds, saw Ahsoka dueling Vader, and then pulled her into the realm during his time period. After Ezra saved Ahsoka and pulled her into the world between worlds, Ahsoka returned to Malachor and her timeline of 3 BBY, and we saw her enter a dark tunnel and that's all we see happen to her. However, there's a series of canon trading cards that were created by Dave Filoni and released by Topps that shed some light on what happened to Ahsoka after we saw saw her walk into that tunnel. In the series of cards, we found out that Ahsoka traveled deeper into the tunnel on Malachor, she eventually found a stream in the Convor Morai waiting for her, Ahsoka then entered the stream and followed Morai to another portal into the world between worlds, she stepped inside of it and embarked on a spiritual journey that changed the course of her life. We have no clue what happened to her when she went back into the world between worlds though, and how that journey changed her life. Since we know that the world between worlds links all moments in time together, there's a possibility that, after Ahsoka re-entered the world between worlds, she went back in time, encountered the 8th brother, which would explain why she duels him in the trailer. This could also explain why there are two Dark Jedi in the Ahsoka trailer, one of which can be seen with Ahsoka in the world between worlds. Again, this hasn't been stated by any of the show's creators and I'm just putting pieces together based on what we got from the trailer, so I could be totally wrong. However, at the bare minimum, I think the upcoming Ahsoka series is going to show Ahsoka's experience within the world between worlds, so fans may get to see Ahsoka travel to different time periods within the Star Wars timeline. All right, time for me to take off my tinfoil hat here. Whether this happens in the series or not, I seriously cannot wait for Ahsoka. This series looks amazing and looks like it'll be a ton of fun. But what's your thoughts? Do you think I'm onto something with my theory? Let me know your thoughts down in the comments. If you like this video, please help out the channel by hitting that like button and making sure you subscribe. Follow the channel on TikTok at SW Transmissions. Thanks for watching and may the force be with you.